or a loved one is diagnosed with hearing loss, there are many options to combat it, including some different types of hearing aids. Derek Francis explains the different types in tonight's medical moment. For a majority of Americans diagnosed with hearing loss, a hearing aid is the best option. A hearing aid is a small um, electronic device, very sophisticated, that you either wear in or, in or behind your ear, um, which basically amplifies the sound so that you're able to hear better. Dr. Katherine Kozak, audiologist at Spectrum Health, says the traditional in-the-ear aid is becoming less common. All the components are basically in a, in a shell that fits in your ear, um, fits in the whole bowl concha part of the ear or the ones that fit down deep in the ear canal. Behind the ear aids are not only less noticeable, but are often more effective. This is a behind the ear open fit style uh, hearing aid that goes up and over the top of your ear with a thin wire and earpiece that sits in the ear. These are the most popular nowadays, so we fit um, most of, of this style. A third and less common style is what audiologists call an invisibly in the canal hearing aid. It sits deep in the canal and is essentially invisible to the public. This is used uh, mainly for cosmetics, so those for those people who are concerned more sure. about the looks, sure. they'll go with something sure. like this. It is a daily daily use hearing aid, so you are uh, putting it in and taking it out every um, every day. Certain hearing aids have what's called a telecoil built-in feature. What that means is that the hearing aid is compatible with loop systems. Loop systems are usually installed in or can be installed in public venues, churches, theaters, auditoriums, uh, airports, and what that does is it allows you to wirelessly connect into their, say, their intercom system. So the signal is transmitted directly to uh, to the hearing aid. What you may find surprising is hearing aids are not covered by most insurance plans or Medicare. And this virtually essential device ranges widely in price from $800 up to several thousand dollars. So you basically pick the style, the, the looks of the hearing aid, and then you choose the level of technology that you want to go with. It's the amount of features that are involved in the hearing aid, the sophistication okay. of of the aid, the way it handles the background noise, the the wind noise, um, the way the directional microphones perform. Derek Francis, Fox 17 News. Boy, those have come a long way, huh? Yeah, definitely. Absolutely. Well, uh, temperatures going up, but I did have a call.